Hello. Welcome. Thank you for joining today. We are doing a little bit of a Korean study session. And hopefully we'll go for about an hour and also some chatting. I'm not sure how long we'll go, but we'll see. We'll give it a try. Hello, Juma. Thank you for joining. Welcome. Hello, Vitamin and Arachan. Hello, Josh. Hello. Thank you for coming here. Hope you're having a nice day. Jared's Journal. Korean is such a beautiful language. I agree with you, and that's one of the reasons I would like to learn. So thank you so much for joining. Catpatch. Hi, Josh. Hello. Thank you, Catpatch. How are you? Hope you're having a good day today. Hope you are all having a great day. Let's see what we can do here. Uh, soup soak, we cheap chewing. Hello, welcome. Thank you for joining. I hope that I said your name correctly. Yeah, I'm good, Josh. Thanks. That's great. Great to hear. Great to hear. Today, I'm going to try to increase the animals to level one and also modifiers to level one and maybe we'll give food a try too we're still on level one overall but eventually i'd like to get to level two but let's start with animals this is the last lesson for animals mysterious cat hello thank you for joining hope you're having a great day or night Okay, which one is crab? Yeah. Okay. Oh, okay. Is that the is that the same as dog? That sounds like the same as dog. But I'm not sure. Uh, let's see here. Annie's house. Hello. Thank you for joining. How are you? Hope you're having a great day today. Ah, oh, which one of these is elephant? Uh, Kogiri. I didn't know that. Kogiri. Kogiri. Kokiri. Oh, Kokiri. Kokiri. I guess that's Kokiri. I love elephant. I love elephant. Uh, let's see. Pangawayo, Pangawayo. Hello, I'm fine day. That's great. Is this Duolingo? Yes, Jared, this is Duolingo. And this is the paid version of Duolingo. Uh, it's exactly the same as the free version, only with the paid version. I don't have any limit. And also with the paid version, I have more motivation to uh, keep going. I had the free version a long time ago, but with the free version, I kind of just stopped using the app. And within the last two months, I started again. Okay, Gachinun is magpie. Gachinun Urii Chingu Imnida. Magpies are our friends. I like magpies. Hello, Mrs. H. Hello, thank you for joining. How are you? Hope you're having a great day. Nabika Namnida Namnida. So I would say the butterfly, I don't know this. Namnida flies. The butterfly flies. 
Navika Namnida. Navika Namnida. Namnida. Jared's journal says, same. Now I'm considering the paid version. Ha ha ha. Yes. Well, I, I like it, personally. Uh, which language did you want to try? The good thing is you can, with the paid version, you can try any language. Like if I wanted to study a different language, I could study a different language, but I think I need to focus on Korean. Okay, what am I doing here? Let's continue. I was trying to read something that was a little bit confusing. Weop. Weom. Weom. Weom is danger. Weom. Oh, okay. So sometimes people say weom a or something like that. Korean for the Korean drama and Japanese for the anime. Haha. <laughs> That's a smart choice. Good choice. Hello, Wood Park Picture Books. Welcome. My favorite company. Nabika <laughs> Weom Huh? Anayo. Nabika Weom. That means don't be scared of butterflies, right? Don't be scared of butterflies. Sometimes they're scary. They're beautiful, but they're scary if they come too close. And you're not prepared. Yongun, is that dragons? Yongun, we am hamnida. Be careful. No. Dang dragons are dangerous. That is true. Dragons are dangerous. However, I don't know if that's true because I've never met a dragon and perhaps they could be friendly. They're only dangerous if you're trying to steal their eggs. Perhaps. Annie's house says Joshi Chom Shilshigan Chingueo. This might does that mean it's my first live stream? I think. Thank you. Wow. Chongmalyo. That means really? Right? Maybe. Joshim ha shipshio sang oga isumida. What is that? Sangoga. A shark. Sangoga. Joshim Hashipshio Sanga Sangoga Isumida. Be careful, I guess. No, watch out. Watch out. There is a shark. Watch out, there is a shark, I believe. That's correct. Ramyun mashi soyo. Na nadu ramyun nomu joaheo. Mekju. Mekju is also good. I did not did not drink mekju for a long time. Oh, uh, kore ru. Kore ru. What is that? Kore ru. These are all animals that I don't actually know very well. Koreru is whale. Jap, jap, shida. Let's catch. Let's catch the whale. Let's catch the whale. I would love to become a whale one day. That would be good. If I could become a whale. That would be a dream. Chonin Mail Kero Moksumnida. I eat 
crabs because mail is every day. So I eat crabs every day. Good for you, bad for the crab. Kachinun noreirul mot hamnida. A magpie cannot sing. Ha, huh, that's funny. That's funny because they love singing. They love screaming. They're always screaming. Uh Youngun, Sangab Simnida, thank you for joining. Welcome. Nabi. Nabi, butterfly. Aha, bad for crab, so funny. Not for the crab. <laughs> not for the crab and not for my bad jokes. Young dragon. Kore nun nomu kumnida. Kore. Is that whale? Whales. Okay, whales are nomu, so I guess that's too big. Nomu kumnida. Whales are too big. Hmm, I don't know, maybe. <laughs> Youngun opsimnida. There is no dragon. There is no dragon. There is no dragon. Great work. Harder. I eat crabs every day. So chonun. Male. Ah. Uh, Okay, I guess that's right. And next we have, watch out, there is a shark. So, Joshim, Joshim Hashipshio. That makes me feel like I'm traveling. Like every time you travel, they always say this. Joshim... A ship show. There is a shark. Hmm, shark. All right, Songaga. No, Songaga. Songaga isimnida. Uh, simply Donna Vlogs. Welcome. Thank you for joining. And, uh, Boda Nyanyang. Annyeonghaseyo. Welcome. Thank you for coming. Happy you could be here. Oh, good. We finished here. Okay. Yay, we're on level one now. So we have 22 crowns. I don't know what that means. Scholar achievement leveled up. Learn 500 new words. Okay. Do you want to go to level two? I don't really want to go to level two yet. Should we take a quiz? I guess I can take a quiz. If I take a quiz, then, um, then I can skip everything in level one. I don't think I know everything, but let's try. Let's just see. Okay, Dayu Gyeongun, goodbye. Thank you for joining. Hope you have a great day, great evening, and Looney Vlogs, hi everyone, good luck on your studies, Josh. Thank you so much, and thank you for joining. We're taking a quiz right now. Oh no. Hmm. <laughs> First one is tough. And there's no answers. You can't you can't get any help here. So Young I think is bottle. Datala. Datala. I don't know this one. Datala. Close the bottle is just my guess. Close the bottle. I don't know this, but it's a guess. Okay. Datala. I guess I was right. 
87달러는 얼마야? 87달러 달러는 얼마야? That means how much is 87 dollars? That would be 8만 7천 원. 8만 7천 원. Wood Park Picture Books. Let's try the quiz. We're trying it and nice. You can do it. Thank you. I can do it. I heard some amazing speech about positivity, so I want to be very positive. Good job. Thank you. Charming. Hey there. Hello. Welcome. Thank you for joining. How are you? Hope you're having a good day. I'm taking a quiz right now to see if I can get to this level too. He does not forget Korean. Well, we'll see. Uh, he does not forget Korean. Uh, throw away garbage. I guess. Anayo. I don't think that's right. But. Boryo. And. Seregi, that means garbage. Ichi, I'm not sure about Ichi, so um, this is a little bit confusing. Okay. Kunun Hangukarul Ichi. That's probably what it was. Ichi Anayo. Whoops. First mistake. Um, Deb Johnny. Hey Josh, how's it going? Hello, thank you for joining. I really appreciate you joining. How are you today? Looney Vlog says, What is the best way to learn Korean vocabulary? That's a tough question uh, because I'm not the best at vocabulary. So I guess just repetition. Um, you know, everyone learns a little bit differently. And for me, I sometimes make the same mistake again and again. So I think just repetition until you get it right. Uh, some people like writing it down again and again, so that could also be an option. And there are some other apps which are more fun that could help you. I've tried Drops. That was a good one. Do you have a taxi? Taxi ja. Okay, you know what's uh, interesting is almost all of these I don't remember from previous lessons. I feel like so all of these sentences must be sentences from level two and not from level one. Oh man. Oh. Ta. Tam. Mi. Il. Oh, whoops. Oh. Oh, I didn't know there's a zero. I didn't know there's a zero. I thought it was just five, four, three, two, one. Too bad, that was an easy one. I see I'm taking lessons on the Talk To Me in Korean website, but I feel like I can't learn much vocabulary. I actually also used Talk To Me in Korean before, and I really like their lessons, but I 100% agree with you. It's really hard to get more vocabulary. Like, you can learn the easy words, but then you get stuck at a certain point and it's hard to get past. So that's kind of my problem at the moment. Annie's house says, Josh, fighting, don't worry. Well, thank you for the encouragement. Vitamin says, fighting. 
thank you guys. That helps a lot. Oh my gosh, that's a pretty long one. Grandmother wears socks and shoes. That's a funny sentence. Oh man. Uh I guess grandson? I have no idea. Is a student. These are all from level two, which I haven't even gotten to. Good job. Thank you. Thank you for saying that. Is Korean easy? Um, no. I would say so-so. So-so. Uh, some parts are easy. Some parts are difficult. I think probably compared to some languages, it could be easier. And some languages, it could be more difficult. I guess it all depends. It is a great website to learn grammar and sentence making for sure, but I think I will try uh, to get a dictionary or something to learn vocabulary. You know, that's a really good idea uh, because sometimes having a dictionary could be helpful. I have a lot of Korean textbooks and they are all hiding somewhere because I usually don't use them. I usually buy the book with good intentions, and then after I buy them, I don't use them. Kamsamnida. Oh, yeah, very good. Chaleso. Dev Johnny. But repetition sure works. I saw parasites so many times, so, so many times, I don't need subtitles. Wow, that is excellent. That's actually a great way, is from Korean dramas or movies. I heard a lot of people learn from, like, Netflix and stuff. Uh, I really should watch more Korean dramas. The poor pink Ani vlogger. Hi, Josh. Hi. Welcome. Thank you for joining. Hope you have a... are, are having a nice day today. Learning foreign language is always difficult but fun. Even Koreans sometimes use Korean dictionaries. Not everyone writes them fluently. Uh, that is so impressive. I agree, that is so impressive. And yes, the dictionaries are um, sometimes used. If you watch a Korean drama too many times, you can easily the Korean drama without subtitles. Yes, that's, that's good. I usually, my problem... First of all, I don't watch a lot of dramas. Because I usually don't have much time. But if I do watch a drama, I usually don't watch the same drama two times. I usually go to a next show or something. That's just me personally. Yes, watching TV show, definitely helpful. Onje ne yodong sengi kamera ru sayong ani. Wow, these are hard. When does your sister buy? I thought it would be buy, but it seems like use is the only option. When does your sister use the, the or that? Camera rule. Sayong. I really don't know. I thought it was buy at the camera, but maybe use the camera. This stuff. Wow. I got it right. I don't feel like I know the answer. I feel like I'm just figuring out the answer. But I don't know if I really know the answer. Thank you guys. Yeah, thank you everyone for your help. It's um it's so great to have so much positive encouragement. And if everybody is trying to learn something and better themselves, 
then we all should be very supportive and positive because I think that's really important for learning. 네, 동생. My brother or 동생이 younger sibling. Uh I don't know what that means. Hmm. Hmm. Was just born. I'm just guessing. Wow. This is funny to me. I'm laughing because I I don't know the answer. I'm just at this point I'm guessing the correct answer. So I have to certainly finish level one. But I'm taking the level 2 test, just for fun. Ooh. Good guess, thank you. It was a good guess. It was the correct guess. Sometimes it's better to be lucky than smart. Do you guys agree with that? Joe. Joe. A trillion dollars. I actually am very good with money in terms of uh language oh my goodness uh of course i would get that wrong i was right iljo means a trillion but i said a trillion dollars so that was my mistake but i knew iljo was trillion to be honest if you ever visit korea most foreigners even if they're not very good at korean language they're very good at money because that's like the most useful thing that you can learn because um, you have to buy stuff and you need to know the price so you learn money super fast. Watching kids shows helps too because the conversation is so simple. Wow. You have a lot of great advice. Maybe more advice than I have and I agree with you. That's a great thing. And Debjani, yes, this is Duolingo. This is the website for Duolingo. It's also available as an app on your phone. Does the student receive a book? Hmm. Does the student receive a book? Oh, this stuff. Haksang in. That was right. Cheku. On. What did I say? On Duna. What did I say? Oh. Oh, okay. Well, I still would have got that wrong, but it was close. It was close. The poor pink Annie vlogger. I will say a goodbye until we meet again. Bye bye. Well, thank you for coming here. I really appreciate you watching for a bit, and I look forward to seeing you next time. So have a wonderful day. Thank you so much. Wood Park Picture Books. Good guess. Thank you. Thank you. So are we, there are many things we don't know about American English. Well, there are many things that I don't know about American English too. I don't think anybody knows everything. I think English is so difficult that nobody knows everything about American English. And if you do know every, everything about American English, that means I guarantee you're the person that doesn't know any slang. So, yeah. <clears throat> um, one moment. Let's see. Uh, see you again. Thanks for joining. Oh, Dania. Anya Haseo, welcome. Welcome for joining. Good to see you again. How are you? 
The cover photo looks great. Makes me feel thirsty. You know what? It makes me feel thirsty too. And I am drinking a late night cafe latte. So I'm getting a little thirsty. Late night iced cafe latte. Can you guys drink coffee late at night? Or does it make you stay up? I put on the belt. Uh, in Korea right now, it is 9.05 p.m. on Wednesday, June 23rd. I forgot the date for a moment. June 23rd. The cow gets beef by accident. What? What? The cow? The cow, Soga, gets beef by accident. Hmm. I have no idea. I have no idea. I have no idea. Soga Soko Giru Uyan He Odinda. I think I gotta get back to level one. <laughs> Oh, late night coffee sounds good. I can drink at night. Sadly, it will make me stay up all night. Maybe that's the reason you want coffee at night, so that you can stay up all night. I'm a uni student, so I live on coffee. Well, I am not a uni student, and I also live on coffee. And I started when I was a uh, after university. After I graduated university is when I really started drinking coffee. Before university, I kind of, in high school, would try with, like, cappuccino. That's how I started. And then, eventually, I got hooked on coffee. I feel like when you start drinking coffee, it's a little bit like starting some like coffee addiction and you trying to get you starts with something sweet usually like a cappuccino or a vanilla latte or chai tea latte something sweet and then you get like a little bit more bitter a little more bitter and then eventually you just like black coffee and then if you really extreme you go to espresso shots that's just my opinion i don't know if that's true Annie's house. I also really like cafe latte. Me too. That's one of my favorites. I could drink cafe latte every day. Nanin cappuccino. Oh, I like cappuccino. It's a weird sentence. You don't need to feel bad about it. No one would say that sentence. Thank you so much, mysterious cat. I appreciate that. An addiction, yes, especially iced coffee. Iced coffee is so good, especially in the summertime. Nuga? Who orders the pizza? Pizza rule jumun hananya? Who orders pizza? Oh, no, da. Who orders pizza? I showed my daughter your previous video. She was like, see, see, this is why Korea attracts me. Why don't you take me there? And I was like, do you think going to Korea is free of cost? Ha, huh, that's funny. That's really funny. Um, you know, I don't know how old your daughter is, but if she is, like, going to be at some time... I have no idea when, but at some time, if she's going to be a university student, there are study abroad programs. So that could be an option 
if she wants to study abroad, then maybe Korea could be a good place. Otherwise, visiting is certainly good too, and I hope you guys do come to Korea. Certainly it's not free, but it's worth it, I think. I definitely recommend coming here. I'm very happy being here. Jungup. Jungup. I actually don't know what that means, Jungup. Jungup. No clue. Gloves? Glove? Huh. <laughs> I guess I'm getting good at guessing. Oh, you improved your score. You scored 2.5 out of 5. You improved your score by 40%. Wow. That's... Well, now I feel pretty good about myself because I, I thought I wasn't doing very good. And actually, I got two wrong, which I knew were correct answers. The one was the Iljo, was, which was one trillion. I said one trillion dollars. And then another one was, I forgot, zero for the five, four, three, two, one. I just put five, four, three, two, one, not I, five, four, three, two, one, zero. So if I would have pressed zero, then the score could have even been higher. So, yeah, I'm pretty happy about that. 40% return on a stock. That would be a great return. So 40% on my on my uh my quiz. I'm impressed. Not impressed. No, but I'm satisfied. Okay. Happy about that. People are nice and food great in Korea. I 100% agree, Mysterious Cat. She should visit visit and people are super nice everywhere you go if you ever need help with anything you can just ask anybody and people are very friendly they will help you you'll never get lost and um people are really kind and honest you don't have to worry about having your money stolen or anything like that so it's a really friendly place for um traveling and living, living too. And the food, great. Yes, food is definitely good. Good job, Josh. Thank you so much, Wood Park. She is 13 years old, but behaves like a two year old. Ha <laughs> ha. That's funny. That is funny. Okay, well, we can't go to level two yet. So let's try to improve level one. I believe we need to get better at level one. Let's try to get these modifiers to level one. Right now we're at level one, 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 two, one, one, two, zero. We have five lessons to get to level one. I don't know if we can do it, but let's let's get a start on and see how we how we go. Done. I don't know what that is. Done. Sweet. Okay. Sweet orange. Or do I say a sweet orange? A sweet orange. Dan orange. Dan orange. And next. Cake ga shimnika is the cake shimnika. I guess that means sour. Because none of the other answers are even possible. Shimnika, sour. Shimnika. Is the cake sour? Shimnika, so shimnika means sour. I use gochujang to make Korean fried chicken and we love it so much. Wow, fried chicken is so delicious. And if you're using gochujang, it must taste really good. Who that pizza is spicy. Mewayo. Oh. Spicy ramen is delicious. Oh, do I say tastes delicious or is delicious? I think is delicious. Spicy ramen. Mayun ramen. Okay, I was right. 
우리는 긴 책을 읽습니다. 우리는 긴 책을 읽습니다. 아, 읽습니다. What is 긴? Long. Oh, okay. 우리는 our no? Oh, we. We read a long book. We read. No, read. Read. We read a long book. That was confusing. I was confusing myself because in English, read and read are exactly the same. 신사과. 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 Sour apple. No. Shin Sagwa. Oh, I forgot this. Yeah, it's gotta be sour, huh? Right. Shin Sagwa. I like sour apple candy flavor. Nomu Shingwai. Nomu. Nomu. Shin Gwai. Gwai. Really sour fruit. Really sour fruit. Oh, if you've ever had passion fruit raw, that is so sour. The moment it touches your mouth, you're like, wow, you cannot uh, make any, any uh, straight face because that is so sour. Cool. I like sweet apple, not sour one. Sweet apple, not sour one. Um, sweet. Oh, yeah. I like sweet, but if for some reason, if it's a caramel apple, I like a sour one. Honey. I love honey. Honey is a superfood. Honey does not expire, so you can have a thousand year old honey and you'll be okay. I like, oh, I've had it as juice. So good. I agree. Uh, Mysterious Cat, I believe, maybe the character on the screen. I believe that's what you're saying. Gochu, oh, Gochu, Gochu, Gochu Jang. Gochu nu nomu me sumnida. So, chili peppers are spicy. Chili peppers are spicy. No, what did I say? Oh. You know, I do that a lot. I do that a lot. I I made a mistake. I said, I forgot to say too spicy. Nomu. Nomu means too. Kugulun Goyo. That. Gyul. Tangerine. Gyulun. Choyo is sour. Choyo. I love gyul because they're fun to throw. You can throw and catch the gyul. That's a tangerine. People like to eat tangerines a lot. Uh, I think in the winter time from Jeju. Jeju Island. Jakun Sagwanun. Dalayo. Okay. The small apple, Jakun apple, is sweet. Jakun Sagwanun Dalayo. The small apple is sweet. Gyul is so nice. Nice picture of a gyul there. Sultang Hago Gyul. Uh, no, not cool. Gul un shiji anayo. I don't know this word. Shiji. Shiji, not sour. Okay. Sugar and honey are not sour. Sultang hago gul un shiji anayo. Okay. 이긴 책은 재미없습니다. 이긴 책은 재미없습니다. Okay, this long book is boring. 
재미 없습니다. It's boring. Too bad for that author. I would feel bad if I wrote a really long book and someone said it was boring. Because maybe it's true for some long books, but I feel bad for the person who spent all that time and energy writing it. 저는 단 음식을 먹습니다. Hmm. I... Ah, oh, what is that? Sweet. Okay, see, I keep forgetting this one. Sweet. Mm, I like sweet food. Moksim, no. I, I eat. I eat sweet food. I eat sweet food. Danya says, I was thinking about going to Korea for a specific residency in the near future, but I'm having second thoughts because I'm only a beginner in the language and I need to be advanced much more. Oh, really? Well, I can tell you that if your language is not advanced, you could probably still come to Korea. Uh, I think you'd probably be okay if you came to Korea. Your language most likely would improve really quickly. And I don't know what level you are, but yeah, don't give up on your thoughts for coming to Korea. I don't know the nature of the specific residency, but if you're worried about language, then don't really worry too much unless that specific program requires like a high proficiency but otherwise if you're worried about like communicating with people don't worry at all mama latina hello my friend very nice sharing and like like thank you so much i really appreciate you coming hope you're having a nice day today Practice makes a man perfect. Keep on practicing. In Korea, you will be a pro. That, I mean, Korean. Yes, Korean. I guess I, I just uh, knew what you meant, but I didn't necessarily read it correctly. And um, thank you, my friend. Have a nice day. Yeah, have a nice day, too. And Dania says, I can have a basic convo. Oh, well, conversation. If you can have a conversation, then you are probably better than me, honestly. So you could definitely survive here, and then maybe you could even uh, join the program, hopefully. Matrix 22, good morning or evening. Welcome so much. Thank you so much. Welcome so much. No, thank you so much for coming. How's it going? How are you? I was thinking about dermatology. I hope so. If you are good at basic conversation, it could be enough to travel around. Definitely would be more than enough to travel around. And if you're good enough for basic conversation, you can ask people for help and they would be so happy to help you. If you needed help from anyone, they would be so overjoyed to spend time helping you and then you can make a lot of friends like that too okay bangi dalayo the bread is sweet dalayo sweet the bread is sweet matrix 22 how are you how's it going we are on vacation and had to join well i'm happy to hear you're on vacation vacation that's great and i'm happy that you guys are able to join um wise hakim i'm late sorry well thank you so much for joining welcome i'm happy that you could make it and i don't know if i'm saying this correctly but let's see i don't know how to pronounce goya goya if i said that wrong i'm really sorry but good morning from Montreal. 
getting ready to start my work day. I wish everyone an evening, day, and yes, keep studying, practicing. Learning a new language is priceless. Yes, I agree, and thank you for joining, and I hope that you have, you have a wonderful day today at work. Hopefully, you don't have to work too much. And yes, hi, thank you at Wood Park Picture Books and Hanin Kore. Hello, welcome. How are you? Thank you for joining. Hope you're having a good day or had a good day and still having a good day. Chonun Dan Gulu Joa Hamnida. I like sweet. Uh, Ooh, I thought that... Oh, honey. I like sweet honey. What kind of honey is not sweet, though, really? What kind of honey is not sweet? Shin guayil. Sour. That means sour. Shin is sour. Guayil is fruit. Sour fruits. There are a lot of sour fruit. There are uh, many sour fruits. Mani means many, isoyo means there are. So there are many sour fruits. Korean is a little confusing because in English we say something like there are many sour fruits, but in Korean it says sour fruits, many there are. So you have to like kind of flip it. I'm glad I got that right because if I would have gave that explanation and got it wrong, that could have been really embarrassing. Uh, let's see. Hello. Yuck, yuck. Yuck, yuck. Uh, Kachi Sanin Da Gyeongi. Hey, what's up? Hello. Welcome. Hongbu Yoshimi. Ane. Yule. Thank you for joining. Uh, how are you guys? Hope you're having a good day today. Mayun sogum. Mayun sogum. Spicy salt. That's a funny word, but I don't know. Is, sp is salt spicy? I guess it could be. Subject, object, verb instead of subject, verb, object. Right. I think that is correct. Gochunun nomu mepsumnida. Okay, peppers are okay too spicy. Last time I forgot too. Peppers are too spicy. Oh, oof! I said peppers. I should have said chili peppers, but I made a mistake. Okay, we did it. Now we have four more. So let's try to keep going here. Yonga is English. Yonga is not easy. Is not easy. Ship G means easy. Ship and then G means not. So is not easy. Thank you, Matrix. Maybe you guys can learn some Korean from this and say hello to everybody there. I hope that um, we can join you guys very soon. Let's see. 그 언어가 예뻐요. 그 언어가 예뻐요. Okay. That language is pretty. So, ona means language. Ku means that. And then, 예뻐요. 예뻐요 means pretty. That language is pretty. 이 책은 어려워요. 이 책은 어려워요. So, this book, that means 이 책을 no, un, that means this book, oriawayo, is difficult. Is difficult. I would love to learn how to speak Korean. I think you would probably be really good at Korean. I'm sure you'd be good at it. Oh, cheer up. I have to English too, but so lazy. Ha <laughs> ha. I understand how you feel. But you can do it, so... Fighting, I guess. In Korea, in Korea we say fighting or cheer up, but 
in English, it's just kind of like a word of encouragement, like you can do it or hang in there or way to go. That's all fighting. Hangukonun is Korean easy? Hangukonun ship ship sumnika ship sumnika. Huh? Because my memory, my disease is MS. Oh, really? Well, I think you can do it. Or Matrix says you got this. That is true. Matrix could be a, a good person to ask. It means you got this. Um, right. Oh, uh. John E. Eagle, Young Akonguga, Boneo, Dueneo, Dueneo. I study English too. Is this right? John, that means I, Eagle, Young Akonguga, that means also, I also study Dueneo. I'm not really sure. Maybe some of the um, other people can answer, but it it seems right. I'm really not very good at translation. <laughs> um, it seems like your English is probably a lot better than my Korean, so you're probably right. Fighting. Thank you so much. Yeah, I try English every day like this. Well, that's great. You can join my channel anytime and have a chat with me in English or Korean. That means I also think that, Josh. Oh, I also study. No, that is great. Thank you. I see. Thank you. Thank you. I'm so happy to see everybody um, helping each other and improving and learning and studying together. So that is really great. Joshinun, Hanguka, Annie's house, Yonga. Yes, Annie's house, English, Joshinun, Korean, Hanguka. Okay, Jakun Yojai ga, Arya un, Chekul. That's a long, difficult question. Dagun means small. The small girl. The small girl. Yojai ga means girl. Oryaun means difficult. Cheku yuk. Okay, reads a difficult book. Cheku means book. Ilk sumnida means reads. And Aryaun means difficult. Okay, I'm always happy I got it correct because I'm I'm like explaining the answer and then if I'm wrong, then it's really embarrassing. <laughs> that means Korean is not difficult. Hangukaru no Hangukanun means Korean, Aryopji means not. And then anayo difficult. Hangukonun, that's Korean, is easy. Oh, I don't know what that means. Ana imnida. So is an easy language. Hangukonun, shiwayo means would be. Hanguko is Korean is easy. Hangukonun, shiun ana means. Ana means language. So that means... Yeah. Cat Cape. Hello. Hello, Josh. Hello. Welcome. Thank you for joining. I'm really happy to see you here. How are you? And let's see. E. E. Okay, this easy language is difficult. 
This easy language is difficult. That is tough. A girl reads uh, Celine and Ella. Yes, Celine and Ella. That is our book, Wood Park Picture Books. Uh, we wrote that book. It's called Celine and Ella, Dear My Gravity. So, one moment. It is this one. This book right here. If you are in Korea or Italy, you can actually find this book on, well, in any bookstore in Korea, really. It's called Celine and Ella. It's always in my background. Um, anyway, hello, another cat person here. I'm happy there's so many cat people here. I'm also a cat person, and there is a cat right here. She's not on the camera, but she is right here. Hoo hoo hoo, would love to learn Korean. And, uh, oh, you're a writer. Yes, I am a writer. And we I wrote this book with my wife. And she is also an illustrator. So this is a book that is created by both of us. And actually, Wood Park Picture Books is our company. So we're the ones who made this one. It's called Celine and Ella. Dear My Gravity, uh, if you can see there, it, well, it's out of focus, but it says Wood Park Picture Books. This is a very great book. Well, thank you so much. I didn't know you read it, but I really appreciate that. Thank you. We can all study Korean and English here. Yes, definitely. I would love for us to all be able to improve ourselves, improve English, improve Korean, or just be positive together. I think all that positive energy can definitely help us, uh, and it's great to be around so many positive minds. So, thank you for that. Dania says, that's wonderful. Thank you so much. Matrix22, you both are great creatives and writers. I really appreciate that. Thank you so much. That really means so much to us every time we hear that. Um, it, it means more than we can express in words. L.A. Hana. Welcome. Is it... Oh, yeah. Hannah or Hana? Hannah? Hannah, maybe. Hello, everyone. Nice work. Well, thank you. Thank you for joining. Happy to see you here. Thank you so much. Big heart and love from Wood Park. Yes. And um, publication is great. Thank you. I really appreciate that. Thank you, Matrix. It means a lot to us. Yes. Uh, thank you all so much. I really do, well, we really do appreciate it. That's Wood Park Picture Books. If you can see the two heads on Wood Park Picture Books, there's two heads. Uh, the one with the hamburger is me, and the one with the ice cream cone, that one is my wife. So, that's us. I love the name, Wood Park. Well, thank you. We're, we like it, too. Happy you like the name. Maybe if you come to Korea, you can find our book someday in the bookstore. <laughs> Funny. The puppy. Hmm. Difficult. Uh, but that's hard to make a sentence in English. The puppy on a on a row. Language. Difficult speaking a language. The puppy 
this doesn't make sense, is difficult speaking a language, but that English sentence sounds weird. Hmm. The puppy is speaking in a difficult language. Okay, that makes more sense. That is, that is tough. The puppy is speaking in a difficult language. Huh. Wow, is it true? Um, is what true? Sorry, did I miss something? Maybe I missed something. I'm not sure. Is what true? Dog language is a lot simpler than cat language, I think. Um, yeah, dogs, they express themselves very easily. And cats, sometimes you don't know what they're thinking. But sometimes you know exactly what they're thinking. In my case... My cat is always screaming like rah, 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 for two reasons. Number one, she's hungry. Number two, she needs to use the litter box. She needs to use the bathroom. Those are the two reasons. And she never, never, if she's hungry or needs to use the bathroom, she always announces it strongly. Uh, where, which state you used to live in USA? Minnesota. I am from Minnesota. Great place. Lovely state. If you see any negative news on TV that is not realistic for what it's like, it's a beautiful place. I highly recommend going there. Kion Koyangi. Oh. Cute cat. Cute cat. Nice Minnesotans. Yeah, Minnesotans are nice. 작은 강아지가 운동을 해요. 작은 강아지가 small. 운동을 해요. The small dog, no, the small puppy exercises. The small puppy exercise is good for that puppy. I see. My cousin's cat used to do her business at random places in the house when she wanted attention from them and they were busy. Wow. That is hilarious and so funny and terrible. Oh, I like that. Do her business. That's a nice way to say it. Um... Unfortunately, when cats do that, it smells horrible. <laughs> and I hope that, um, I hope that her method of doing her business in places she shouldn't, I hope that helped her get more attention. Did it help? Kyun Gangaji, cute puppy. Cute puppy. Orion onaril beupnida. Okay, Orion. A difficult language. Upshida, beupshida. Oh, okay, let's learn a difficult language. Let's learn a difficult language. Oh, really? I have lived in Iowa and visited Minnesota many times. Well, my my best friend is from Iowa, and he actually used to live um, in Iowa. So, and I saw, I, I went to Iowa quite often because it was pretty close to Minnesota. Annie's house. See you next time, everyone. Well, thank you, Annie's house. I'm, I was really happy to see you, and I appreciate you joining. I hope you have a great evening, and see you in the next one, or see you next time. Thank you. So, L.A. Hannah, I guess you live in L.A. now. How does L.A. compare to, how does L.A. compare to Iowa? I bet that's uh, a bit different. Healing nature. Kure che 
channel healing nature hi nice to meet you nice to meet you too healing nature thank you for coming i'm happy to see you here yes nice weather i've only been to la for once or one time and it was very short it was for visiting the convention center so i would love to go again I visited Koreatown one time, uh, and that was quite fun. Let's see. Yojai ga hyun Okay. The girl reads. So Yojai ga is the girl. Reads is ilgoyo. Chekul is book. So an easy book. Um, Gangajiga Oroun Onoro Malheo. Oh, okay. The puppy is that's Gangaji, and then speaking is Malheo. A difficult language is Oroun is difficult, and then language is Onoro. Gangajiga Oroun Onoro Malheo. The puppy is speaking a difficult language. I hope that's correct. Yes, it's correct. Let me get a drink real quick. I'm drinking a cafe latte. It is 9.45 and drinking a late night cafe latte. I don't need to wake up too early tomorrow so I can have a coffee at night. I could drink coffee all day long, honestly. Like, if that was the only thing I drank, I could really seriously drink cafe all uh, coffee. I was gonna say cafe. I can drink coffee all day. Cafe all day. That would be funny. I could stay in a cafe all day. L.A. is much different than Minnesota. Matrix 22, I agree with you. What did you think was the biggest difference? What's the biggest difference between L.A. and Minnesota, other than the weather? Other than the weather. Jaminin, that means interesting language. An interesting language. Oh, no. That means tasteless mat omnun. That means tasteless bulgogi. Lifestyle and pace. Okay, I can see that, but what do you mean? Whose pace is faster or slower? LA is fast paced and Minnesota uh, more laid back. Okay, I see that. Maybe all those lakes. Matrix 22, oh, well, I don't know how many lakes there are, but in Minnesota, everybody has a cabin on a lake. That is one Minnesota thing, is in the summer, you go and visit somebody's house who has a cabin on a lake, and literally every single person you know knows someone who has a cabin on a lake. Would you agree with me? Devjani, bye for now. Stay safe. Goodbye, and thank you so much. I always appreciate you coming here, and um, hope that you can tell your daughter to visit Korea sometime, and maybe she can convince you to, uh, to come, even if it's not free. Thank you so much, anyway, and have a great day. Matrix, hello. Yes. Checky. Opnun. Dosogwan. The library? No. A library without books is just a building. A library without books is just a building, I guess. Here's a terrible joke for you guys. Terrible joke time, okay? What is the tallest building 
in the world. Does anybody know what is the tallest building in the world? Yes, that is the laid back nature in Minnesota. Fishing, skiing, snowmobiling. Snowmobiling is so much fun. I've only done it a couple times when I was younger. But it is awesome. It's a blast. What's the tallest building in the world? Well, this is a joke, by the way. It's a bad joke. I didn't make it, so don't attack me for telling you. But the tallest building in the world is the library because it has the most stories has the most stories. Okay, I know you may be laughing. It's okay to laugh. Even if you don't want to laugh, you can let yourself laugh. You know, don't feel bad. Don't feel bad if you like it. LA, fast cars, lavish lifestyles, beach life. People in LA don't see snow during winter, but people see too much snow. Tallest building in the world, I don't know. Unreasonable. Or maybe everybody loves reading, so the library, everyone took all the books from the library because they're all reading. Uh, awesome. That's like a dad joke. I love dad jokes. I don't know why they're called dad jokes. I just think they're called jokes. Don't you think? What's the difference? Why does it have to be a dad joke? Why can't it just be a joke? But I like dad jokes, too. It is a good one. Thank you. Thank you for laughing, people. Thank you for laughing. Jimmy Opnen. Oh, no. That's sad. Chonin Jimmy Opnen. Check the little hello. I hate boring books. I hate boring books. Because people do not like giving dads credit. We are witty. That's true. Why why not? I mean people just people usually hear a dad joke and they roll their eyes like, oh ho oh, oh, that's terrible. But inside they're thinking, wow, that's hilarious. That's a really good one. They just don't want to admit it. What's wrong with people? They don't want to admit that dad jokes are, are funny. They're always good. They're always clean. I think it's just they want to hear more, but they don't want to encourage it. Minnesota, too much snow in winter. Yeah, that's true. I love the snow personally, though. I really like the snow. Sometimes I miss the days where the snow is like, so high that you could build a tunnel. Uh, wow, Kamsamnida, Pangawayo. Thank you, nice to meet you. It's, it is dad joke and universal for daddy to have a certain joke style. Is it universal? To humble us. <laughs> um, Chugi Ilsung, wow, nice to meet Josh, it's so good. Well, thank you, I'm so happy to see you here. And thank you for coming, I hope you're having a nice evening. Daddy joke in Korean, Ajegeg. Yes, Matrix in Korea, they have a word which is Ajegeg, and that means daddy joke. Okay, Granny, Hanguk. Hanguk Halmoni, welcome. Happy to see you here. How are you? How are you? I'm happy that you could make it. Awesome. Awesome. Everything is awesome. By the way, did you guys see in, in China, they built a 10-story house, a 10-story house in one day. It was amazing. Basically, they had pre-built sections, and then they just 
brought everything to the construction site and they built it like Legos. They built the whole house like Legos. 10 story house in one day. Pretty amazing. I don't know if it's safe. Hopefully it's safe. But it seemed safe because once they connect them, they like screw them into place. It seems safe. Uh, we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. But anyway, it's amazing. Uh, Matrix says, does daddy joke have the same meaning in Korea? Yes, it's exactly the same meaning in Korea. Danya, one day. Wow, that is amazing. Yes, that really is amazing. It, it can take like two years sometimes to build a house, 10 stories. Uh, but here, not here, but in China, they did it in one day. We'll see if it's safe. I think it's safe. It looks safe. Uh, when I watched the video, I thought it didn't seem like, oh, that seems dangerous. You know, sometimes you watch a video and you're like, oh, that seems dangerous. Okay. Anya Haseo, Angu Palmoni. Wow, Danya, you're really good at Korean. You can definitely come to Korea now, probably. Dad jokes could be lame and funny at the same time. Huh. How could it be lame and funny? It's either just funny or it's just lame. But no, I agree with you. It could be lame and funny. Sometimes, because it is so lame, it is funny. I delete Gajang, Jamie Opnin, Young Haru Boyo. Ooh, that's tough. The children. Hmm. Gajang is most. Jamie Opnin. Mm. The children watch the most boring movie. Is that correct? Okay, good. Gajang is the most. Jamie Opnun is boring. Young Hua Rul is movie. Huayo means watch. Okay, so. One day. One day. Mm, that is amazing. Oh, where am I? Oh, I'm so far behind here. LOL, lol. In Korea, LOL can mean two things. It could be laugh out loud, but it could also be the really popular game called League of Legends. Most people, they say LOL for League of Legends, which is like a, a Leroy Jenkins style game. The most. And laughing faces. I love the laughing faces. It makes me happy. Kabangi, that's backpack. Eatin ai. I don't know what that means. A uh, child's bag? I don't know. A child with a bag. Okay. Kabangi. Eatin ai. A child with a bag. That one's tough. I don't get it. Oh, wow. Cool. I love Leroy. Me too. How can you not love Leroy? He is... Leroy Jenkins is a living... Well, I don't know if he's living, but he is a legend in the game. For those of you that don't know, Leroy Jenkins is a famous gamer tag who... In a online game, people were preparing to go to battle, and Leroy Jenkins just ran into battle alone, and then his team was worried because they were supposed to go together, so they all followed him in, and they all died in about 10 seconds. Maybe less than 10 seconds. <laughs> They just saw him leading the battle and screaming his own name. And then uh, 
Yeah, everyone in, went in there and got slaughtered. I'm laughing so hard right now, my face hurts, smiling so hard. Yeah, me too. My face uh, doesn't doesn't hurt, but I am smiling. I should watch that video here together. Um, yes, that would be fun. I don't know if I'm going to do that though, because I don't really want to open up my my YouTube at the moment, and I want to keep going with this one, even though I am getting distracted. Okay, Mashinun Sokoginun Mani Pisayo. Ah, delicious. Mashinun is delicious. Sogogi. Delicious beef is expensive. Sogogi is beef, my favorite food. Mani. Oh, very expensive. Pisayo is expensive. Um. Marin Blue Jay, hello, hello, welcome, thank you for joining. Thank you so much for joining. Out of context, can we say Giga Jaka Kuda? Would it make sense? You're talking about the height, I guess? Maybe Wood Park Picture Books could answer that question. I think that means the height is tall. Giga Kuda, that means tall, and Jaka would mean short. I think Giga Kuda is correct, meaning that person is tall or tall. Uh, let's see. Matrix 22, I just had bulgogi last week. Oh, really? That's amazing. Did you cook it at home or did you go to a Korean restaurant or how did you have the bulgogi? No. Okay, sometimes when I focus, I got this intense stare because I'm thinking. So, Kajang Mashinun Ramyanun. The most delicious ramyun is spicy. The most delicious ramen, delicious ramyun is spicy. I just had. Oh, we did cook it at home. Oh, that's amazing. Danya, you can say Kika. Dr. Kika Kuda. Okay, thank you, Wood Park Picture Books. That's very helpful. I also needed that lesson. Um. Thanks, ramen like. Nadu, ramen juaheo. Marin Blue Jay. The dog. So go giru mokji anayo. The dog does does not eat tasteless beef. Hega would be dog. Mat opnun would be tasteless. So go giru would be beef. Mokji anayo means doesn't eat. The dog does not eat the tasteless beef. Um, let's see. The there are these meal options that you can purchase from a company called HelloFresh. Comes with directions and everything. I absolutely loved it. Wow, Matrix, that's amazing. Uh sounds really delicious, and meal kits are really, really popular nowadays. They're so convenient because all the ingredients are included and it's so easy to prepare. You just cook it and follow the directions. So it's really good for people like me who are not very good at cooking. Um, you just prepare what is there. Also with meal kits, it's really also nice because 
if you go to the supermarket, you have to buy so many ingredients and you have to buy a lot of ingredients. And then you have there's tons of ingredients that you didn't use. So yeah, meal kits are good for getting the right amount of the product you need. Mysterious Cat says meal kit is mega trend. It is a mega trend in Korea too. So if you are in Korea, we also order meal kits, even from restaurants, even from restaurants where you would go and eat at the restaurant, you can actually order from that restaurant and the restaurant will give you their ingredients and then you can cook it in your house. So it's like having the exact same restaurant food just cooked in your house. Good for a large family like ours. Everyone can help. It's so fun to cook as a family. You know what? That is amazing that you guys are all cooking together and ha making it a family thing that is super special, super cool. And I guess that's why you guys are probably so good at the game Overcooked. I bet that helps. Overcooked is uh, one of the best games you can play. Onu? What is that? Oh, which? Onu wine e kajan sumnika? Bitter, okay. Which wine is the most bitter? Onu is which wine e is wine kajang the most? Simnika, Simnika, bitter. Cute hi. Hi. Modern Blue J, hi. I don't know who you're talking to, but hello. I think that is cute. If they are cooking together, we love Overcooked as well. It's it gets pretty tense though. Playing Overcooked is the only time we are allowed to yell at each other. Okay. I think for some reason, uh, cooking shows, they always get angry in the kitchen. So Overcooked makes cooking, which could be stressful, an even more stressful thing because you're cooking in the most insane circumstances and conditions. Is that a rule where Okay, if we play Overwatched, we can yell at each other, uh, overcook, overcooked. I said over Overwatched. Overcooked. Um, if we play Overcooked, we can yell at each other. So maybe if you get in a fight, you could say, hey, let's play Overcooked so we can go yell at each other. Shiga Eatnin Yori. Hello. Hello, welcome. Thank you for joining. Happy to see you here. How are you today? Um, Healy Nature. Wow, that's a large family. Happy family. That is. They are a wonderful, happy model family. Uh, the just the nicest, truly. Daniel Gordon Ramsay is what I think of when there is an angry chef. Yeah, me too, actually. He is the ideal angry chef. And he is my favorite. I love watching Gordon Ramsay. I like watching him yelling. The reason I like watching him yelling is because he is so creative when he is yelling at people. It's just funny. I was actually thinking if Gordon Ramsay was yelling at me, and saying something hilarious, it would be hard not to laugh. Because, um, and the funny thing is, his anger is sincere. Especially when they give him raw meat. He's always like, my favorite is when he says, it's still running in the field. <laughs> it's still running in the field. Or the other thing says, a good veterinarian could put this thing back to life. I heard him say that one. The meat, people were cooking some steak or something, and it was undercooked. And he said, 
A good vet, a good veterinarian could bring this back to life because it was so undercooked. I thought that was hilarious. Okay. Uh, Mitch Love, eat ASMR. Hello, thank you for joining. How are you today? Modern Blue Jay, hi again. Ramsey is so creative. Yes, he is. Ha ha ha. Ha ha. Ha ha ha. That's me reading a lot of ha ha ha's. Funny family. Danya, you should see him with his daughter. He's like a whole other person. Yes, I have seen him on YouTube with his daughter. And it's super sweet. He is a different person. And that's probably because his daughter is actually a good chef. So there's no reason to be screaming at her. And also, if he was screaming at her, it probably wouldn't really be good for him. So, yeah. You can tell on the show, it's totally different. <laughs> running lamb, running sheep. Running sheep, undercooked. That could be a game. That could be a game you guys play, undercooked. Josh, you don't need to read ha ha ha's, ha 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 ha. Well, I like reading the ha ha ha's, okay? Thank you for the advice, Wood Park Picture Books. I agree, maybe it sounds funny for me to say ha ha ha, but it is kind of, I don't know, I like reading it. Ha 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 ha, ha. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Ha 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 ha. Okay. As long as you're happy, as long as I'm happy, I'm happy. That makes sense because I'm the one who's happy. But as long as you are happy, I am also happy. I guess all this coffee at night is making me a little bit crazy. But wouldn't that make, wouldn't that make sense? As long as I am happy, I'm happy. That is pointing out the obvious. Okay, as long as I'm happy. Okay, Woodpark, I disagree. He must read the ha-has. <laughs> okay. Happiness is key. I agree. I agree with that sentence. And I hope everybody here is happy. And if you were not happy, then I hope that you can become happy. Ha ha ha. Okay. Ha 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 To see if he would read all the has. All the has. Yes, I did. I did, and I enjoyed it. It was a little too many ha's, but I still enjoyed it. Modern Blue Jay, me funny. Ha ha, that's great. Me too. I'm also funny. Coo -coo -coo -coo, so funny. What about he 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 he's? I like he 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 he's too. <laughs> Today's stream is best. I guess it's the funniest because of all the laughing. Dance. Oh. Uh, Modern Blue Jay, I think you're better at that than me. I'm not very good at dancing. If I start dancing, I might break your, your screen. I don't want to break your screen. Don't want to break your computer screen with my dancing because my dancing is very good. Or not, we'll never know. Actually, one of my favorite games on Nintendo Switch was Just Dance. Just Dance. They show so many difficult dance moves, but the interesting thing is even if you're terrible at the game, you can still get a perfect, like perfect, perfect, but it's not really, not really that, that good. My face hurts. That's good. I'm happy your face hurts. Hopefully because you're laughing, not because something else like a toothache or something. What about DDR? You are great at that or used to be at least. Thank you. I did love DDR. That means dance, dance revolution. And our neighbor wouldn't like, <laughs> yes, our neighbor wouldn't like DDR because we live in an, a high rise apartment building. And if you play DDR, 
our neighbor is going to call us and complain about the noise because we're going to be basically jumping on their ceiling. But you know, I used to play DDR with my controller. I actually just got a new controller mm, this week or last week. New controller. Yay! And I love it. It's very good, very comfortable. I used to play DDR on the controller. It's not exactly dancing, but um, I, I also had the dance pads, but with the controller, it's also really fun. Um, I played it on Wii. The fun is everlasting. The fun is everlasting. And actually, on Wii, and I think just dance, they have an endless mode, don't they? Where the music just keeps going, so you can actually dance for like, well, forever. Usually they give you a warning like, hey, don't work out too much or you could be injured. Member, Iron Blue Jay, member. Yes, thank you. Uh, haha. Oh, I got, I got you. No, you shouldn't play DDR. Oh, nice controller. Nice controller. Haha, thank you. I'm happy with this controller. I recommend this product for two reasons. Number one, it's USB type C. This is an impromptu, impromptu sudden product review. Mine is, it's also wireless, it's Bluetooth. My new favorite feature is it has a 3.5 millimeter headphone jack which also connects to the microphone. So you can connect your ear phones here, you can hear the game and you can chat. And you can chat with the game. Okay. Wood Park picture books. Let's keep studying. Wink. Yeah. Good call. Good call. I need that. Sometimes I need that. Get off off track. Let them sponsor you. I would love them to sponsor me. Please let them sponsor me. I'll take it. I support them anyway. Uri Nun, Jamie Nun, Young Hua Ru, Hamke, Bomnida. Uh, let's. Mm, we. Jamie Nun, interesting movie. So we watch. We watch an interesting movie together. Good job. We watch an interesting movie together. Shelly60, hello, hello. Hello, hello, welcome. Thank you for joining. I'm happy to see you here. How are you today? Sengaki opnun saram. Okay. Haha. Does that does that mean thoughtless person? Thoughtless person? Sengaki Obnun Saram. Huh, that is funny. I like it. Sengaki Obnun Saram. That makes me laugh. Good. Oh, good. That's good. Happy to hear that. Umshiki Obnun Shikdang. Umshiki Food Obnun Shikdang. Why are they making these funny sentences? A restaurant? Without food, a restaurant without food must be very popular or must just be very popular. They're sold out. Kajang Jamie Noon, the most interesting Chekul book reading. Ilkoyo, I'm reading the most interesting book. Chekul. Okay. Uh, what can I say? Reading. Ilkoyo. Ilkoyo. Where is that? Cheko Ilkoyo. Hmm. Let's read. Let's read the most interesting book. Let's read the most interesting book. 
Um, let's see, Matrix, because they saw we were talking about dad jokes. What do you mean because? Did I miss something? What What is before because? Because they saw we were talking about dad jokes. Hmm. That must be it. What did I miss? Did I miss something? Oh, the sentences. I'm, <laughs> I'm in two different worlds here. I feel like this study world and the chat world are a little bit different, so I'm not connecting what you're you're reacting to what I'm the sentence the crazy sentences here. Kabangi eat nun ai. A child with a bag. <clears throat> no, no. You were asked why we were getting Funny sentences. Sorry about that. Those sentences. You asked why we're getting funny sentences to study, and they heard us, our dad jokes. Okay, I needed to drink. My throat was getting too dry. The crazy sentence is, yes, Matrix, no need to be sorry. <clears throat> okay. No need to be sorry. Okay, we earned 67 XP today. Having a little trouble breathing at the moment. Let's check where we are. We are ranked number 8 right now. Wow, look at Sam up there. Number 8. Okay. Let's do... We only have two more. <clears throat> Let's give it a try. I'll try to do it quicker. And I need a drink because something is in my throat. You have to get to number one. Let's go. I appreciate that, Matrix. Um, I don't believe it's possible at the moment. But we definitely can climb higher than number eight. But number one is... <clears throat> it's too high, actually. Uh, oh, anyway. Jusuru mashinun yojai ga hiyop simnida. Juice. A girl... Drinking juice is cute, <clears throat> I think. If there is a will, there is a way. Danya, I like that positivity. And yes, I agree with you. If there is a will, there is a way. Maybe I shouldn't have said that. I have the will. I'm going on the way. Hopefully we'll get there. We'll get there. Nanin Utnin Chinguru Juahamnida. Juahamnida. I laugh. Hmm. Utnin. Friends who make me laugh. No, friends who laugh. I like. I like friends. 
who laugh. <clears throat> oh, good. I like friends who laugh. That's true. That's a true sentence for me. Nanen utnun chingurul joa hamnida. If you have friends that can make you laugh, then that is very good. Moknun saram. Person who is eating. Moknun saram. Person who is eating. Hmm. The chicken soup that the child eats is spicy. Okay. <clears throat> the chicken soup that the child eats is spicy. 책을 읽는 학생이 내 친구입니다. 책을 읽는 책을 읽는 학생이 내 친구입니다. Okay. The student reading a book is my friend. The student reading a book is my friend. 저는 여자아이가 김밥을 먹어요. 저는 여자아이가 김밥을 먹어요. Okay. The no. 저는 What? 저는 I thought that was I. Hmm. The girl. Maybe that's that person. The girl. 저는 <clears throat> The girl eats kimbap. No. Oh. Chanan. Chanan. I was reading it wrong. I couldn't. I thought that said Chanan. Okay, the sleeping girl eats kimbap. <laughs> that sentence is ridiculous. That means she's sleeping and eating kimbap in her sleep. What kind of girl is eating kimbap while she's sleeping? That is hilarious. Um, exactly, mysterious cat. How can you eat and sleep in? <laughs> well, actually, it happened to me one time. I'll be honest. I was on a football bus, and we were traveling to another city to play a game, and I was sleeping, and my mouth is open, and someone put a Skittle in my mouth. And when they put it, I was sleeping, and they put the candy in my mouth, and I just started chewing it. And I woke up because everybody was laughing. They were like, oh, he's eating it, he's eating it. And I, because I was sleeping, and I just started chewing it, and I woke up, and I was eating it, and people <laughs> were laughing at me because I ate it. That is a 100% true story. And I was confused, but I was... I was like, "Ah, it's good. I'm happy you gave me that Skittles." Anyway, I just remembered that now. That was a memory that was lost, and now I got it back. Ha 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 ha. Dali nun, dali nun, nam jaga tung tung hamnida. Okay. Dali nun. Dali nun. The man running is fat. The man running is fat. Chipuro kanen. What is this? Kanen. Going. Gil. Road. Chipuro kanen. Gil. The road going home. The road going home. Oh, the road home. Isn't that like a movie or a song or a book? The Road Home. It sounds familiar. Oh, Dania, I missed this one. You said, I also read Cho. The sentences keep getting weirder. Yeah, that's true. The sentences do keep getting weirder. You know what, though? In a strange way, I think the sentences being strange is actually very 
helpful. And the reason I think it's helpful is not because I'm going to use that sentence, but it's helpful because it really tests if you actually understand what the sentence means. Because most of the time you can normally guess what is the correct sentence. So like when I was taking the test, even if I didn't know the correct sentence, I could guess what it meant and I could guess correctly. But if there's something really strange, like the cow is eating bulgogi, well, it's so strange where it's like, you have to know exactly what it says. So it's almost like it's really testing your, your knowledge, even if it is strange. We can probably make a great meme with you reading ha-has. With you reading ha-has. Yes, uh, Wood Park picture books. That would be nice. I could see that. I'll be happy to see that meme. <laughs> I don't know how you could do it, but <clears throat> go for it and send it to me. A compilation. Oh my gosh, that could be like... Someone could make a music video. It could be like a whole three minute music video with the flashing lights and the ha 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 ha's. Kind of like that one with the, what is that? That is called, um, disappointed. That disappointed. And it's like a remix of the disappointed. That would be funny. Dress free life. Hello. Welcome. How are you? Um, did you just, get home or did you get home early i think that's what you said last time but anyway thank you for joining happy to see you here i'm so late that's okay i'm happy to see you anyway okay chonun chanun namjaim nida chonun chana is that right is this right i am I am a sleeping man. Is that right? Chonin Chanin Nam Chamnida. Is that right? <laughs> I like that sentence. I am a sleeping man. Okay. Oh, okay. I had dinner out. Stress free life. What did you have for dinner? How was it? Hopefully, it was delicious. Unun gangaji. That means. Uh, I thought that was funny. I thought that meant funny. Unin. Smiling. Unun. I thought that was funny, but it means smiling. A smiling gangaji. Who doesn't love a smiley gangaji? That means puppy. Pasta sounds good. I cooked pasta yesterday and how are you doing doing well thank you so much we are actually we've been studying korean for two hours straight uh but it wasn't 100 percent studying we had a bit of a laugh and talked about some other things as well which i really enjoyed Chanin namja. Chanin namja. a sleeping man a sleeping man. I love the name Stress Free Life, except I'd have to switch free to full to match my reality. A stressful life. Oh boy. Danya, that could be a, like, a, the same level of joke as before, and I like it. A stressful life. That would be funny. A stressful life would be the nemesis of stress-free life. Wow, it's been two hours. Time went fast. Yeah, it did go fast for me too. Thank you, Mysterious Cat. Matrix 22, we distracted you. Yes, you did, but not really because I like the distraction. And the title of this stream is called Study and Chat. So, if we didn't chat... I should change the title to just say study, but I'm happy that we can have study and chat. Glad I still catch up. Yes, I'm glad too. Ha 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 ha. Yeah, ha ha. There was a lot of 
ha ha ha's today. That should be the title. Actually, that should be the title of the video. I should change the title. After this stream, I'm going to change the title to Korean Study and Chat Live. Ha ha ha. And we'll see if that helps. Because that's a realistic description of today's stream. Oh, man. Yon. A cute boy re is reading. No. A cute boy reading a book. So, Yon Nam Jai is a cute boy. Chegul Yugnun reading. A fun way to study. Yeah, ha 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 ha. It really is. Ha 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 ha. I agree. It is a fun way to study. It's actually the best way that I've ever studied, maybe in my life. I'm not joking either. I'm not joking. Mashinun Kedulun Jakayo. Hmm, that's tough. Mashinun is drinking. Kedulun Jakayo. Oh, cold? Cold? The dog? No, are small. Oh, Jakayo is small. I was thinking cha, like cold. Okay, that's my mistake. Okay. Small dogs are drinking. That would be very cute. Small dogs drinking are very cute and excellent ASMR. Okay, I got that wrong. The drinking dogs are small. Small dogs are drinking. Wow. Surprised by that one. Smiling. I learned that today. Utnun ai ga chekul ilkoyo. Okay. The child, the smiling child, reads a book. The smiling child reads a book. Must be a good book. Stress-free life says that was a bit hard, and I agree with you 100%. That was a bit hard. Oh boy, we're back with the sleeping kimbap eating girl. The sleeping girl eats kimbap. What a talent. Mashinun kedulun chagayo. Okay, uh, small dogs are drinking. Small dogs are drinking. What? I just did the same mistake again. I just did exactly the same mistake. The drinking dogs are small. Okay, the drinking dogs are small. The drinking dogs are small. Okay, I see. Huh. Try again. Yeah, the, the program wants me to try again. That was the only one that I kept making a mistake on. Yay, 78 XP today. Let's see where we are. We went from number 8, and now we are at number 6. Above, I believe that's probably Jesus, but it does look like Jesus. So I guess he he probably knows Korean. So I guess that's Jesus. I'm sure he knows Korean. He probably knows. He knows every language. Uh, oh, yay. Thank you. Thank you so much. All right. We're going to do one more, and this will be the last one for today's stream, okay? Thank you, Wood Park Picture Books. We're going to get this modifier to level 1, and then we'll be done. Level 1 and done. And that will be today's last uh, challenge. So, let's get a perfect score. Let's try and get a perfect score. Agi is baby. I like that face. Agi. Agi. 
Chumul Chunun. What does this mean? Dancing. Chunun. Chumul. Chumul. Dancing. Dancing? What? Dancing, dancing? Hmm. A dancing baby. I guess. I guess. Oh yeah, I guess that is a dancing baby. But why is it Chumul Chunun? That's confusing. Joanna Roxanne. Joanna Roxanne. It's already nighttime there. There. Oh my god. Ha ha ha. Ha ha. Thank you for joining. Welcome. Happy to see you here. And yes, it is nighttime. It is currently um, 10.40 p.m. at night on Wednesday, June 6th. No, June 23rd. June 23rd. I said June 6th because I was looking at the date and it said 6th. June 23rd. So we are on Wednesday, June 23rd, 1040 at night. How are you doing? Danya, Chum is dance. You're right. I learned that just now. Stress-free life. Wow, excellent. Hello, my morning just started with my students. I told them you're learning Korean and they got excited. Oh, really? Um, which students are you telling? I didn't know that. Or how did, what did you say to them? You learn, I'm learning Korean. Okay. Happy they got excited. <laughs> I'm happy uh, if anyone gets excited about learning Korean. Because I also get excited when I learn Korean here. Mashichi Anin Namja. What is this? Anin. Who does not drink? Oh, okay. A man who does not drink. Man who does not drink. Does not drink. That's kind of like me. I do drink, but I have not drank for a long time. So. Anin mashiji anin namja. I like beer. I like drinking, but I didn't drink for a long time. Gumu. Gunun Haksang. Hmm. Hmm. I want to say dreaming, but I don't know Gunun. I know Haksang is student. Huh. What is this Gunun? Dreaming? Dreaming. Oh, that is so confusing to me. What is Gumul Gunun? Why do they say dreaming? Dreaming. A student is dreaming. Student is dreaming. That, that sounds wrong to me. Dreaming student. What am I doing? Yeah, that should be dreaming student. Um, dreaming, gumu gunun. Oh, okay. It's a phrase. Thank you, mysterious cat. It's a phrase that goes together. So that's what that means. I didn't realize that. Okay, I learned that today. That's something good. Oh, chumu chunun is dancing. Thank you. Thank you for that. I really appreciate that lesson. Nanin K. What? Dog? Nanin. Flying dog? Nanin? Hmm, that's confusing too. Flying dog. Now, I'm... I was gonna do... I wanted to get a perfect score on this last one, and this last one is giving the mo giving me the most confusion. Taranjeep. That means another house. Another house. Jeep means house. Onulun. Onulun. Taran. 
다른 집, 다른 집. 음? I thought that was 집. 오늘은 다른 길을 봐요. Oh. 길을 봐요. Let's look at another dog today. Let's look after another dog today. Let's look after another dog today. Stress-free life. Difficulty level now. Yeah, the difficulty level is getting more difficult now. What about singing? No re hanen? No re hanen. I think that sounds right. That sounds correct. Mysterious cat, are you able to help? Is that also correct? No re hanun means a person who's singing. No re hanun saram. Person who's singing. Nun makes noun or verb to adjectives or adverbs. Verb. Okay. Wow, this is such a great a great way to learn because if I don't understand something on the program. I can ask you guys to help me and get the answer. So that's super, super nice. So thank you so much. 나는 우는 아기를 싫어합니다. 나는 우는 아기를 싫어합니다. 우는. 우는. Crying. Okay. I knew cry, but I didn't know 우는. 나는 I hate. I hate crying babies. I hate crying babies. That's that's a little harsh, but like maybe true a little bit because some people, you know, don't really enjoy crying babies to a point, to a point. Sometimes it's okay. If it's on an airplane, I understand why the baby is crying because I also want to cry, but unfortunately, it just feels like, "Oh, please stop crying." But I never get upset because I understand it's not a pleasant situation for a baby or an adult. However, nowadays, I would be happy to take an airplane somewhere. I really want to travel. I haven't been on an airplane for like three years, I believe. Private tutors, haha, singing nore hanen is correct. Thank you, mysterious cat. Ruvi. Hmm. Hello, Ruby. That is a lot of ease. Stress free life. Same. Aha, same. Chumul chunungye. Chumun, no, chumul chunungye. Okay, that means a dancing dog. I would love to see a dancing dog because that would be super cute. That would be super cute. Uh, let's see. Beagle Bambi. Hi. Hello, Beagle Bambi. Welcome. Thank you for joining. Having the baby on an airplane is already stressful. It is so uncomfortable because everybody <laughs> looks at you like you are the plague. Oh, that's too bad. I never give anybody a dirty look. If if the baby is crying, I'm thinking, oh, that's too bad for that baby. And I know the family is probably feeling bad too. Like, I wish our baby would stop crying. But I would never want to make that family feel bad. Because I'm sure they also don't want that baby to cry too. But that's funny. <laughs> Looks at you like you're the plague. I guess that sentence has a different meaning nowadays. Danya, thank you. I wanted to know because I love singing. Noreban kagoshi poyo. Oh, <laughs> if you like Noreban, uh, Noreban is very popular in Korea. So you can come to Korea and you can spend time in the Noreban. Yogiye opsoyo. No norebang there. Too bad. I think. Have you ever been in a norebang? Uh, norebang kasoyo. Did you go to a norebang? 
Haha, <laughs> true. Healing nature, I like that. Chumul Chunun, a dancing dog. Where is the dancing dog? Where is the dancing puppy? I want to see the dancing puppy. Okay. Adan Saram Nugueo. <laughs> um, let's see. <clears throat> Who is the other student? No, person. <clears throat> Who is the other person? My voice is going. Anieo Ajikdo. That means you still didn't go. That's too bad. Pinchanayo. You can go sometime. You can go sometime. A sleeping baby. Jiru. What is Jiru? Huh. Is boring. The sleeping baby is boring. That's harsh. <clears throat> that is harsh. The sleeping baby is boring. You should be a dancing baby. Maybe you should take a rest. Yes. After this, after I finish two more, it will be the end. Unun crying. Crying baby is cute. Crying baby is cute. Aginun <laughs> babies sogogi do not like beef. <clears throat> sogogi sogogi rule and juahamida. Babies do not like oh. Babies do not like beef. You have always had a great work ethic. You will be fluent in no time. Thank you so much, Matrix. I really appreciate that. That's so nice of you to say, and I really hope so. And I hope that uh, you guys can watch me become fluent. That's my goal. Uh, and Hmm. Walking baby. Walking baby? Oh, okay. Walking baby. That's that's pretty cool when the baby starts walking. Kumul Gunun Haksang, a dreaming student. Thank you, Stress Free Life. Oh, yay, I pressed the click. I clicked the button too quick, but now we're on level one. Yay, we did it. We did a lot today. We got animals to level one and modifiers to level one. And we made it to number five. We made it to number five. Good job. Yay, congrats. Thank you. Okay, well, I really appreciate all of you here who joined the stream. Thank you so much. It helps a lot. I had a lot of fun. I hope you also had a lot of fun. And I will be streaming again on Friday. So thank you so much. Hope to see you on Friday. Daniel says, great job. Thank you. So yes, everybody, you guys have a great day. Have a great night.
stay safe and see you all on Friday, hopefully. So goodbye.